eco-socialism. What is it? Why did you put that in the title of your book? Well, actually, the term itself has been in use for quite a while now, at least 15 years. In fact, there was an eco-socialist manifesto that was released at the World Social Forum in Brazil uh, almost 10 years ago. Uh, it combines the uh, idea of ecology with that of socialism. And I argue in my book that it's, this is a very natural uh, combination in the sense that both of them clash with the idea that uh, production decisions should be made on the basis of, of profit. They both uh, adhere to the idea that decisions on what to produce, how to produce, and how much of it, and so on, uh, should be made on the basis of some uh, better criterion. And, 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 and eco calls attention to the natural environment, but the socialist criterion is uh, the, the interest of humanity. And the point is that the two are integrally connected. You, you, we can't live without the natural infrastructure. So in one sense, it's even redundant to put the eco prefix onto it because socialism implies that you make decisions on the basis of what's in the interest of people. And you can't legislate in the interest of people without taking into account the environment. However, because of the historical evolution of the awareness of these different dimensions, uh, the eco has to be added on for purposes really of emphasis to call attention to the fact that yes, definitely, this is, this is part of, uh, this is integral to, uh, to our critique of, of capitalist society, it's a critique of what it's done catastrophically and is, it continues to do to the natural environment. You know, it's interesting because on our program we often talk about the bad outcomes when you allow decisions that affect everybody to be made by a very small minority in the society whose job it is in this system to maximize their profit. Right. So people who are doing their job, maximizing their profit of their business, are doing it while the social consequences, or in your case, the natural consequences, could be devastating. And that, that's, not a, that's not an intelligent way to organize human life. Right. And he strikes me as, as you say, it's, a, it's an old idea, reworded, but with the same punch it always did. Right. 